example here, um, we had a wonderful chance to catch up with a very talented uh, group called Baker, who the lead singer is standing right here next to me at the Memorial Hall here at Harrison Hot Springs. I'm excited to have a few words with her. How are you doing this evening? Very well, thanks. Wonderful. And so the name of the um, group is Babe Gur. Yeah, that's my name. And because um, I'm the songwriter in the group and I've put together the group, uh, we just go by my name. And when was this group um, established? Oh, gosh. Probably about 15 years ago, I would say. Yeah. In various incarnations, of course, over the years. But for most part, I'm still playing with a lot of the same guys I've played with from way back when. Very cool. What, what inspires your lyrics and your um, style of music? What is your style of music? Yeah, that's a tough question. It's hard to put me into any one genre. I mean, once upon a time it was easier because I just played roots music, but now um, I'm blending world rhythms and fusing that into my roots music, and that's really come about from traveling a lot and liking a lot of what I'm hearing around the world, and, and I like how music transcends all boundaries and cultures and it brings people together so I decided I'm gonna start doing that I'm gonna fuse things from all over the world and see how it goes and so far it's been fun amazing so what are some of the more favorable places that you travel to in the world oh gosh well I've been quite a few places been down to uh, Central America Europe a number of times Uh, I've been to uh, Turkey just recently and um, uh, let's see throughout the states of course and Canada yeah wonderful um i'm sure like along your um endeavors of you know participating in a band and reaching your potential that you've uh, experienced some sort of setback setbacks if so how have you sort of moved forward what's the sort of train of thought well i think for me um music's always been a dream and i truly believe people should follow their passion follow their dream and not worry so much about what other people think just do it just you know do it because it's so rewarding and it's not always uh, about just making money it's about doing what you love to do it's the journey as they always say right and it's true and I think you know for me any setback I may have had I just shrug it off and just go okay well that can happen in any career any you know part of your life and you just keep moving forward and as long as you know there's people out there that like coming to hear the music we keep moving forward so wonderful and Bring, that brings me to that the question of, of money. Does How do you meet your financial needs? Is this your career? Do you have another career? Is this part of your life or is this your life? This is pretty much my life. I've been doing this for a long time, but I also am a producer. I produce um, CDs for other artists. So that combined with performing is, is my career and I can make ends meet. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. And I'm sure there's a lot of aspiring artists out there, singers, musicians, individuals, youngsters who want to get in, in into bands. What are some positive words of advice that you can provide to them to let them know that they can be, you know, where you are today, performing at a world-renowned resort? Right. Well, I think, you know, the main thing is not to get discouraged. And nothing comes easy in the beginning. You have to get over a certain learning curve. And not to think that you have to be an expert, because you don't. Um, You know, I'm not the best singer, I'm not the best guitar player, I'm not the best songwriter, but maybe what I have to offer touches some people. And um, that's what's important. First, you have to move yourself. And if you can move yourself, then you're gonna move others. And yeah, just not worry about perfection, not worry about being the best. And not thinking that, if you're not on radio or you're not with a record company that you're not worth your salt as a performer because there's so far and few between people that actually do get signed by record labels and honestly if you listen to some of it you're gonna go okay that some of it's wonderful and you know people can sing circles around me or play circles around me and then there's others who can't and yet they're famous and I'm not so I think a lot of kids coming up get caught up in that they think the be all and end alls get a record deal get out there and you have to be famous well that's not true you can make a very nice living having a wonderful time doing it yeah it's all about the journey it's absolutely about the journey yeah wonderful what are some places that you um would like to travel to in the world that you haven't quite made Uh, made it there yet yeah well i'd like to go to south america i'd like to go to argentina because i have a passion for uh, the music and the tango i'd love to go to india it's another place i'm really really dying to go to and maybe israel as well and yeah Mm -hmm. very cool well it was fantastic talking with you thank you so much thank you thank you wonderful performance thanks very much you're welcome